Hi, Sarah here with Faithful Finish Lines, and I am here to talk to you about our healthy holiday challenge and three tips so that you can be absolutely successful with the challenge. We're so excited to get started. Um, it's uh, perfect here. I'm in front of my Christmas tree. I don't know how well you can see the window with the lights, but I wanted to get a little picture of that because we're getting a huge snowstorm. So um, I'm just in the Christmas spirit. This Healthy Holiday Challenge takes place through the month of December and every day we are giving you one small change to make each day. We're also giving you a Bible verse to read. So that's it. It's so realistic, practical, it's nothing crazy, and absolutely anyone can do it. Now this challenge is especially designed for people who want to lose weight or maintain their weight. We know that, um, oh, this time of year, it's so challenging. Um, I've lost 100 pounds and maintained it for the last 10 years. And Becky, who runs Faithful Finish Lines together with me, has also lost 100 pounds. So we've done a lot of Christmases <laughs> and we understand the challenges of the holiday season. And we're here to tell you, you can do it because we've done it every single year of maintaining our weight loss and while we were losing weight. So you can absolutely do this. So three things that I wanted to share with you today. The first one is join the challenge. <laughs> so if you've already done it, you can tick, check off that box. If you haven't joined yet, I will put a link below and make sure that you know how to join. It's easy to join. You'll get some emails, nothing crazy. Um, we're not sending an email every day, but we will send one about once a week. And then when this is over, we've got this really special three-part video series um, that runs right up into the new year because we know that's a time that a lot of people are thinking about goals, even if it's not necessarily a New Year's resolution. Um, you know, it's a time that we're thinking about refreshing, so you'll want to make sure that you see those videos. So you join the challenge. When you join, you get um, this printable workbook, and I'm going to walk through that with you because there's so much good stuff in here that's really going to set you up for success. But before you um, dive into that, number two, so number one was join, so you get that, do that now, or you've already done it. Number two is community. We want you to join our Facebook group. Um, it's Christian Weight Loss uh, for Women with Faithful Finish Lines. If you're not a member yet, please join right away, and I can put a link to that below too. This is such an awesome, supportive group, and that's, this is where a lot of the action is going to happen with the challenge. Every single day, we will be posting what that day's challenge is, and then underneath, you can um, write how you did the challenge. You could take pictures and share them in the group, um, but we know for sure that people do better with support when it comes to weight loss. Research backs this up, scientific research, and in the Bible, too. Um, you know, God encourages us to build one another up, to encourage one another, so that's exactly what we're doing with this challenge. We want to honor God through this holiday season with our eating, but not beat ourselves up, not, um, you know, have tons of guilt, but, uh, but we want to honor God with what we're doing and make healthy choices. Okay, so that's number one. And number two, number three is I want to walk you through how to use this awesome workbook that you get. So I've got a couple different things I'm going to show you with it. This is the workbook. This is just the cover. Now you can print this. You need to print it out. It's digital. You can print this in black and white or in color. We're really conservative with our printer ink around here. I will say though, it's kind of nice to have the color just to, um, there's just something motivating about when things are pretty, but you can totally print it in black and white. Now I've had a couple people ask, I, what if they don't have a printer, what do they do? So a few options, you're not out, there's still plenty you can do. Um, you can just follow along on your computer or your smartphone. If you've got a smartphone, you can even take a screenshot of the pages so they're super easy to access. Um, you also can go to your local library, Office Max, Staples, any of those places will print this for you and it's not very many pages so it won't be expensive. Okay, so you've got your cover. Then the next page is your, that's a little hard to see on the video, but um, your daily challenges with the Bible verse. Now this is the same 
challenges as on the next page, which is a calendar page, but here we just laid them all out for you. Because I know sometimes it's easier like when you're doing your grocery shopping or planning ahead to, um, to be able to see everything all at once. This is a great page to pull out too for those of you who Bible journal. To do your Bible journaling, you can use it for your devotions. So we just wanted to have that available to you. So some of the challenge things that are on here, these are doable, like I said, they're really doable. Number 10, day, day 10, go to bed early. Um, number eight is plan your treats this week. Um, number 19, unplug from technology for the night. So these are doable things that will make a difference with your weight loss or maintaining your weight. Okay, so the next page is our calendar page. Again, I know that's a little hard to see with these lights. But it's a side-by-side -side spread, so um, I got a little confused about that when I first saw it. Becky put this together. She did an absolutely fabulous job. But it's two pages together like your calendar would be. So if you're using this and you want to put it in like a notebook or something like that, you're going to put the pages like this and then it makes a full, a full spread. And on each of the days, you can see um, what that day's challenge is and the Bible verse, so you're all set to go. And then the last is these One Small Change holiday cards. We love these cards. So we have, this is kind of a bonus that we put in for you. We have a product called One Small Change Christian Weight Loss Note Cards. Love for you to check it out. Um, that is a paid product because it's totally worth it. And it has a lot more cards than these, but we wanted to just make a little holiday version so you could get a taste of what they were like. Now this is one part of the workbook that we really do want you to print and cut up because this is what these cards are like. So you take the cards apart, sorry again with the light there, there we go, and then you can use them. Now you don't have to put them on, I put them on some paper, I just stole from my Bible journaling supplies. Um, you can take your kids construction paper or whatever you don't have to put them on paper that was just something I did um, you they're great printed on cardstock that's the ideal way to do it you can even laminate them and use them year after year I just didn't have any cardstock candy and so I printed them and then I put them on um, I put them on paper because you do want them a little bit sturdy this is the, these cards we really encourage you to use so Pull one out, you can do them randomly or choose, pull one out each day, stick it in your car, put it on your mirror, um, you know, stick it at the top of your calendar, put it on your refrigerator. We'd have women who use these all different ways. But we really want you to use them. This is practical, you can see them, you can have that visual reminder that you are making healthy choices this holiday season. So that's the workbook just as you print it out. And I wanted to show you a couple other options too of how you could do it. So the cards are a big one. And then another option is I have a day spring agenda planner. And what I did was I printed the workbook pages that I wanted and I shrunk them down a little bit. And I'm gonna put a, um, a screenshot of how I did that on my computer so that you can see. Everybody's computer and printer are maybe a little bit different, so unfortunately I can't give you exactly, I can't walk you exactly through the steps, but on mine, when I go to print, if I choose custom size, and I shrunk it down to 65%, and then it fit in my calendar perfectly. So, this is what I did. This is the back of my um, agenda planner. So, um, in this one, it has a notes section and I cut it out. I just used a little bit of washi tape and I just ripped this washi tape. You guys, don't work, don't stress about this being perfect. Washi tape isn't supposed to be perfect anyway. It gives you kind of that artistic look. But I've been reading about some people who are really struggling with anxiety. That's more in their Bible journaling because they, they are afraid of messing up. Please don't worry about it. When I cut out my cards, they were crooked. They're not perfect, but they look great and they're motivating to me and that's all that matters. So I've got a two-page spread with the calendar. So this is right here in my agenda. I know exactly what to do. And the other thing I did was I did go ahead and print off the healthy holiday list, challenge list too so that I have it handy again if I just want to use it when I'm looking for the whole week. For the Bible verses, I've got it handy. You don't necessarily have to do that because what's on the calendar 
is the same as what's on this page. We just wanted to give you those different options. So the calendar spread is definitely my favorite. Like this is just something you can so totally use. So I did that in the notes section. The other option you could do, um, this is just my, do it, my regular calendar, messy, messy, is you could use this section. So this is the December section where you've got the different um, page layouts. You could also stick it in there. I just didn't because I might still, I use that for looking at the month as a whole. But it's totally an option that you could do. So, um, so that gives you some ideas for using the workbook. We love the workbook. We're so excited about it. So to recap, um, three tips for how you can be super successful with the Healthy Holiday Challenge. One is join the challenge. Yay! If you've already done it. If not, I'll put the link. You can go do that right now. Two is join the Facebook group. We're gonna have tons of support and community in the Facebook group, and that gives you a little bit of accountability too to stay on track. And then number three is use your workbook because that is such a great resource that we've designed for you. So we are really excited to get started. The other thing I wanted to make sure I mentioned is if you're watching this video later on in the month, like past December 1st, you still absolutely can join and the way we have it set up is you can join any time in the month and you can just jump right into that day and get started so if it's december 10th which happens to be my mom's birthday hi mom um and you join that's totally okay don't feel like because it's december 1st after december 1st now you can't join we've set it up so that you can still join throughout the month of December. And we would love for you to invite some of your friends and family too. That gives you some accountability, but if you'd be willing to share this challenge with them, we really appreciate that too, because we wanna reach as many women as possible who need this, who know they need to lose weight and want to do it in a healthy, realistic way from a Christian perspective keeping God at the center of all of it. That's what Faithful Finish Lines is all about. And this whole challenge, the videos at the end, all of it is completely free. Um, this is our gift to you, um, our way of saying thank you to all of you for supporting us, our way of helping you. We wanted to make it beautiful, and I think we've achieved that and totally free as, um, as something that we can offer you to our community. So I'm Sarah with Faithful Finish Lines together with Becky, and we are so excited. We can't wait to get started on the Healthy Holiday Challenge in just a couple days. So thank you so much for joining me. Bye-bye.